Welcome to another edition of My Opinion here on My Opinion TV reminding you we do new sports and general activities happening in and around the world especially in Jamaica. This morning we want to look at um, the life of the late Chadwick Bosman of Black Panther fame. It's a very sad day for a lot of us who watched that movie and who saw this great character in Chadwick Bosman. I mean, for me, I'm glad I had the opportunity to watch that movie and saw in him the qualities of a truly strong black person. And I mean, when you look at the year 2020, it's so it, it's a year everybody would want to regret. It's a year would like want to turn back. When you look at it, January 2020, everybody was looking at and planning to get to, to what they want to achieve, what they want to do. But now, how, how has the year turned out? The year 2020 has eventually turned out. Not a year to planning to achieve you know, certain goals again. It is turning out to be a year of a lot of reflection and a lot of evaluation. People evaluating their friendship, their relationship, their jobs, their family. And what 2020 has really taught us is to appreciate the things we have, the persons who are around us, the family, the friends. That is what 2020 has really taught us. Coronavirus can, can, um, is present in 2020 and it has disrupted almost every person's life right across the globe. You know, and for to get this news of the passing of Shadrach Bosman, I mean, you know, it culminates... A series of bad events. I mean, in, we we lost Kobe Bryant, um, the coronavirus, so many, so many things. The Black Life Matter is all over the globe, and you know he is also one of those person who stood up for um, the lives of the Ar African Americans because he's from the African American community, and you know, one thing struck me about. What I, I was reading something on the internet and that struck me very in a in a in a very bad way in the sense that he when he was going through his illness he he put a photo up on Instagram and a lot of person without knowing what was happening to him um saw the loss of weight and they decided to cheer him. It happened that he eventually took down the photo off his Instagram page. Now now, what are those persons who jeered him thinking at this present time? Sometimes you see people going through life. You know, it teaches us a lesson. Sometimes you see people going through life. You don't know their situation. You don't know what they're going through. They could be probably going through one of the worst periods in their life. Now, when he posted this photo, a lot of persons who jeered him did not know he was going through a battle with colon cancer. He eventually lost his battle on the 28th of August um, 2020. Um, it moved, he, he was first diagnosed with stage 3 colon cancer in 2016 and it progressed to stage 4 um, before 2020. Now, it just goes to say that, you know, as human beings, we have to be more cognizant, we have to be more sympathetic, we have to be more careful not too quick to tear down each other you understand and can you imagine how distraught he felt going through a battle a cancer treatment and losing away the emotional scar the physical scars all this stuff he was going through and when he posted a picture on instagram the first thing the persons on his page started to do was to jeer him and worried about his weight loss without even trying to find out what's the main cause what 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 about his health what what could be causing this some people thought he was losing weight because maybe he was coming up with an, uh, a new movie and he had to lose weight for it but you see it brings me to the point that we must always be kind to each other always look out for each other we don't know when things will happen to us and the same type of generosity you expect for yourself you ought to give it to somebody else and you know it's just a sad day that we lose shadrick in this manner 
his situation was not really public publicized so a lot of persons is totally unaware of his illness but bro you know here on my tv we just sympathize with the entire family your wife you know for the three years your wife taylor simone Le ledward and going home at 43 years old you know it's pretty young man had a lot of promise you know and i i saw a post by former president barack obama and he says shadwick came to the white house to work with the kids when he was playing jackie robinson you could tell right away that he was blessed to be young gifted and black and to use that power to give them heroes to look up to and to do it while in pain what a use of his life and those were the words of former united states president barack obama but you know it gives it brings us to a point where we reflect let our lives touch somebody as we live on this earth well not the typical my opinion um today but just to reflect on the life of shadrick bosman 43 years old passed away colon cancer took his life and we just want to say rest in peace bro and may life perpetually shine upon you and we wish your family god will give your family strength to go through this so that's the end of my opinion for another day take care look out for your loved one be good and always remember look out for a neighbor